Well, it's 7.26 a.m. And I wake up. Gosh, I wonder if I put this on at two speed. This is another music video. I'll have to see if I can see where it's at and how two speed. Oh, this is a great, this is a great video. This, I forget what his name is, but this guy has one of the great secrets of show business. I want to show this to the um, anyone in show business. This is brilliant because this guy, the guy in the pink, guy in the pink. Hold on, let me see. The guy in the pink, big fat guy. He uh, has found a secret of show business. He has a whole chorus line. Of beautiful girls that dance in with him. I'm gonna actually put this at full speed. There won't be any sound though, because this TV doesn't have any sound. So I'll start playing it at full speed. You'll see it better. See, look at there he is, hugely fat, and yet he has all the a very young crowd. See, and that one boy is so beautiful, and the girls are all beautiful too. And here he's a king. He's a big star. But look what he has surrounding himself with. This is showbiz, people. I mean, I could be a, I could be a pop star if I had a chorus line that looked like that. You, I know. I used to be a zip book editor. I know how to do it. This guy's a genius. Yeah, man. He's a star, but who do you think they're looking at? There, that, that's what they're looking at. Here, here. Go, girls, go. Man, this is what I'd call a proper... I think they used to call it in the business tits and ass show. It was our yeah, it was called it was pornography, and then back in the the seventies, I guess, when I, Jim Buckley and Al Goldstein, they they didn't want to make pornography. Well, actually, the the, the perfect the perfect so called uh, well, I the original tit and ass movie. But I, that's an awful term, but it's legal. But Beach Blanket Bingo with Frankie Avalon in 19, around 1962. And I knew, I knew heterosexual couples that would tell you that they love that movie. And these are guys, a middle aged narrate man. Oh, he was, he was a big, he was a big mystic writer who was a friend of mine. Actually, I know you won't believe this, but on the inside cover of one of his books, he has a reverse negative, like a black and white negative of my first lover performing oral sex on me. And it's done in such an arty way. It's actually in a, pub, in a published book. I forget what his name is. He lives in California. He and his wife, Bur -bur Burzon, hey, that's a B-O-U-R-B-O. -B oh, man, I'm glad I caught that. Well, that's this for now. Let me get in this it's time to let's go back to the real world. Now when you want to go back to the real world, let's do we do this real quick. There's nothing nothing here that you haven't seen before. I got a I have over here somewhere. I have I have this. Now here we go to the real world. And this is really frightening. Okay. That one up there turns on all the time by mistake. And this is on with sound. Why is it HDMI? American Express Open Cards can help you take on a new job. And now, we're in the wrong channel. The real life, the real frightening life right now is happening right now on 65 in the morning. 65 in the morning. This is, this is. It's just literally that he started talking about me because he see that the six are against him. Jackie, thank you very much for the call. The Outlook section of the Washington Post, Trump loves to mock losers. What happens if he becomes one? Story also ah, 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 ah. .com. Okay. Goldberg. I don't want to have copyright issues. I'm not going to be the first one to tell you Donald Trump is going to be killed because he's worked up worked up such hatred and passion that there's so many people that hate him so much, including myself. If I pass him on the street, I'd spit at him and call him a name. 
So I and I'll be amazed if Hillary Clinton wins if she ever takes if she ever takes office. I've been telling my friends that she'll probably be assassinated. So we're really voting on whether we want Greg Pence or Tim Kaine as president. No one thinks in those terms. Well, I live through the John F. Kennedy era. But John F. Kennedy, at least we had the thing of Camelot. So anyway, that's my prediction for now. See there, the one up there is, that's a, that's some sort of a, that was made. Anyway, that's another music, now up on the music video up on the top, that one, if I can find the control, say that I wanted to hear a music video instead of watching Donald Trump's hate-filled thing. I'll play this. I'm sure it's a music, come on. Oh, I have it on real low because I didn't want to. Ah, oh, yes, I have recovered. I am back. I went to sleep at one o'clock, so six hours later after that incredible day, I am back. Alive, I'm back. Oh, so. What a trip it's been.